Hello, I'm Vittorio Pippi from the University of Modena and Reggio Emilia, and I present you our work, and written Test Generation from Visual Archetypes. Few shots styled and written test generation is a challenging task, in particular when it comes to the generation of unseen words in unseen styles. The task is even more difficult when these words contain characters rarely seen during training, which we call long tail characters. To address this challenge, we propose the Visual Archetypes Transformer, which focuses on obtaining a meaningful text representation and a robust style encoding. Text representation is achieved through a novel approach with a sequence of dense vectors called visual archetypes. The robust style encoding is obtained by exploiting specific pre-training on a large synthetic dataset. Our qualitative and quantitative results demonstrate the superiority of our approach over the previous ones that exploits one vector representation of the text. In particular, our transformer-based few-shot styled and written text generation approach takes as input 15 images as examples of the writing style we want to mimic, and a varying length text which is the desired content for the images we want to generate. First, we need to encode the writing style from the example images. To this end, we exploit a robust style encoder. In such a style encoder, we pre-train the convolutional backbone on a massive synthetic dataset. The dataset contains images of more than 10,000 words rendered in more than 10,000 calligraphic fonts, and the backbone was trained to classify the images based on their font. The output vectors of the pre-trained convolutional backbone are fed to a transformer encoder to enrich the style representation via self-attention. As for the representation of the textual content, the common approach in literature is to represent the characters as independent one out vectors. In contrast, in this work, we propose to exploit visual archetypes to represent the characters. Consider, for instance, the characters 1 and 0. These share similar patterns to the characters L and O. To exploit these similarities, we render each character with the GNU unifont on a 16x16 16 16 binary image. This rendering is the visual archetype of the character. Since all visual archetypes lie in the same space and share recurrent visual patterns by construction, they allow us to improve the generation of rare characters by exploiting the knowledge acquired from the more frequent ones. So, given a text to encode, we render each character in its corresponding archetype, and then pass it through a linear layer to obtain a dense representation. The sequence of encoded vectors are used as query for a transformer decoder, which performs cross-attention with the style vectors coming from the transformer encoder. Both quantitative and qualitative evaluations on standard styled and written text generation settings demonstrate the suitability of our approach, which obtains state-of-the-art results. In particular, the pre-trained style encoder stabilizes the training process and reduces the artifacts in the output images. In fact, since we pre-trained the convolutional backbone to filter out the background, the generated samples are cleaner than those generated by the competitors. Moreover, thanks to the visual archetypes, our approach better exploits the text geometric appearance by leveraging the repetitive visual patterns of the characters. This improves the generation of long tail characters and increases the overall quality and readability of generated text images with respect to the competitors. Finally, it's worth noting that since our text encoding is a sequence of images, we have no constraints on which images we can encode. Therefore, despite this goes beyond the scope of our work, we can generate out of charset characters by rendering them in the GNU Unifont, and our Visual Archetypes Transformer will generate them by exploiting the knowledge of the in charset characters seen during training. Thanks for your attention, and if you have any questions or remarks, please reach out to us or drop by our poster session. Bye.